Hello Collective, welcome back to the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. You are greatly appreciated. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families. As always, I return to source. I return to sender. All negative energies and intent immediately and permanently. I call in only the purest of white light and pray that you stay only in the highest of vibrational energies. Whatever the enemy has stolen from you, it is returned to you. All evil and negative plans of the enemies against you are dismantled and being dismantled as we speak. As I have said, so shall it be. Judgment is final. Uh, real quickly, <clears throat> I think I mentioned this in one of my videos, but I feel like I need to say it again so everyone is aware of it. My platform is being tempered with uh, like some third party hacker. Uh, someone is paying uh, whoever to temper with my platform. They're trying to take over my platform. So if you click on my videos and it's taking you to a page that says uh, this website is not available, try again later or something of that nature. There's some type of DDoS attack that's on my platform that I did not. I don't have anything to do with. Basically, they're not wanting people to watch my platform. It's not YouTube. It's somebody else. Um, also, uh, what was I going to say? <laughs> uh, when you click on a link on one of my videos and it also redirects you to a different page, it's not my page. I'm not affiliated with that page. I'm not associated with any other content creator, not a company, not nothing. It is just Cynthia, Cynthia, and Cynthia that manages the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. I don't work with anyone. I don't know anybody. I didn't give permission to anyone to manage my platform. I didn't create a brand account with anyone telling them, hey, you can manage my platform and I'm going to go do this or waste my time. N none of that. So is somebody hacking my platform? Yesterday, I literally spent all day trying to figure out how I can fix my platform because when I try to access it, it's taking me to a page that's not mine. So, and then sometimes I'm able to access it. So I was trying to figure out the ins and in and out about it behind the scenes but there's someone tempering with my platform and i appreciate the sincere subscribers or viewers that come here to watch um if you search my platform's name and keep watching my videos that way um <clears throat> so that we can stay relevant i guess okay but thank you so much for coming to watch my platform my channel and thank you for your support it, it is greatly appreciated excuse me now let's go ahead and get into the tarot uh, so you may have someone that wants to meet with you in order to trap you. There's some type of uh, divine meeting that's being set up um, by a group behind the scenes. It says someone is being sent towards you to make something look like it's legit. It is not legit. This is not a sincere meeting. This is something that's being planned. Uh, thank you. This is someone that's being planned. Uh, something that's being planned. Someone is planning on you or plotting on you. Uh, to trap you in some type of horrendous situation, okay? Yeah, <clears throat> they want to trap you in some type of court case. They want to trap you in some type of legal legalities so that you are more focused on that legality instead of focusing on the things that matter to you. So, uh, for example, since I do divination, I will be trapped, stuck, worried about this court case instead of focusing on my divination practice, right? So, it's like a distraction, uh, so this is basically what they're doing. They don't want you focused on your pathway. They don't want you focused on your life. They don't want you focused on your work. They don't want you focused on nothing. I'm telling you, they don't want you focused on your work. They're trying to steal your work from you, trying to steal your options from you. Don't want you being able to speak out your truth. Don't want you focusing on your dream, plenty of nothing, living in fear of what is going to happen. Am I going to lose my job? Am I going to lose this? Am I on the right path? You are absolutely on the right path. And your commitment to your path has these people in some type of heartbreak, distress, because it's that whatever they do, you're still focused on your pathway. Okay? There's something where it's like a delusional feminine energy out here in an institution. Um, a queen of wands is paying people behind the scenes to force something to go in her way, but this collaboration is over. No one is trying to work with this woman. I think they're done with this nonsense. Something is about to be exposed about a queen of wands and what 
she's been doing behind the scenes. And just like I said, they are taking the initiative to temper with your work, your energy, everything. So you're not a balanced person. They don't want you being seen as balanced. There's some type of collaboration that is over with either a Sagittarius or a higher level soulmate or your ancestors, your angels are stepping in to balance the situation out. So it's like they don't want you working. They don't want you being seen. They don't want you being respected. And your ancestors are stepping in. You could have a leader within a community or an institution that's choosing to dismantle some type of collaboration, some type of group effort to destroy you. And they're choosing to balance something out. And they may have a group of people pissed off, angry, whatever behind the scenes because you are still going to be seen. You are still being seen as authentic. People still want to work with you. People see you as original. You're about to be living your 10 of cups kind of lifestyle. So they're choosing to balance something out because whatever it is these people have been doing just does not resonate. This could be a higher fan as well, like a leader of a community that's choosing to balance something out. And they may have a group of people pissed off feeling... Uh, disappointed whatever this is so this came out in reverse yeah he's choosing to let go of something there's some type of disingenuous i told you listen 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 i told you this meeting was disingenuous right this is a plotted a planned meeting okay with this thing, uh knight of cups coming out in the reverse this is a meeting that's being planned so someone may want to run into you and say oh my gosh what are you doing here oh Honey, I'm just here living my life. But what are you doing here? You should be all the way in yonder. This is never, never land. What are you doing here? Oh, my gosh. You know, my grandma stays down the street. I was just coming to see how she's doing. Meanwhile, grandma ain't even alive. Something like that. Someone is being playing. It's like a plant being placed in your energy because they want something. They're trying to cause some type of illusion, right, to you. Someone wants to come across as being genuine, being a friend. But maybe this is the truth being exposed to you ahead of time before someone takes some type of action to come towards you. Okay? Stay very, very vigilant. Okay? Someone is in a hurry and desperate to do this. You could have a king of pentacles reverse coming towards you. Don't lose a lot of money or he stands to lose a lot of money. If, if he's not able to block you anymore, he's not able to stop a new beginning. He's not able to stop you from being seen by the world, heard by the world in whatever way. It could be at work. <clears throat> it's different from everybody. He, If he's not able to, to trap you, his behind is on the line. He gets no more money. Something like that. Okay? But your strength is overpowering this man. It has him wondering in his mind, how can I end this heifer here? Because she just won't stop moving on. She just won't stop moving. It's like someone has knocked you down 10,000 times, but you still keep getting back up. And at this point, he does not know what to do. It's almost like he sees you as like a robot. He said this, I don't know what to do. I don't do everything I can think of. Sucker is still getting back up. I don't know what to tell you. And they want him to keep going. But the truth is out, which is leading to some type of forward movement. When it comes to wish fulfillment in your investment, you will have your Ten of Pentacles, um, which is something more than likely it's been hitting. You may have some type of opportunity coming towards you. Um, so I don't think you know about this Ten of Pentacles that's coming towards you, but you are going to get what is yours. However, with the, the most high deems it so, but whatever belongs to you, you will receive. Okay, no one's ever going to take your blessing. You keep standing your ground. Something is being protected for you. Okay? Yeah, this came out sideways, but we're just going to put it up here. Yeah, someone may be pissed up, angry, confused at the fact that you're still content in life. You're still happy. How are you still content? We've done everything to, to cause you distress. Uh, we've done a lot of manipulations and things like that. You should be angry. You may even have people popping up out of the blues just... Trying to see like what it can do to temper with your energy. Someone is finding out you're not easily, uh, you're not like someone to easily uh, temp. I don't know how to even put it. Is that someone thought you were like easy to just play around with, and you would just be like, oh my gosh, what is going on? Like they were just gonna keep fooling with you, and you would just like drop the towel, throw it in the towel, drop the ball, and just move on with your life. He said, I don't know, I don't, I don't want to do this anymore. Oh my gosh, I'm so scared. But you're someone that has secret knowledge, and you know exactly what's going on. Someone has put themselves in like the fire. Oh, I said the fire, and the tower came out. Tower came out. So yeah, there's a truth being revealed about someone paying a uh, 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 energy behind the scenes either a couple 
paying a couple to do something behind the scenes or paying a masculine energy to do something behind the scenes because they're forcing, they're wanting to force something to go in their way. They don't want justice playing out. They don't want destiny playing out. Someone is wanting to be seen as a magician, as a higher fan, a high priestess. She wants to be seen as gifted, but it's not going that way. Like there's, there's some type of corruption going on within a community and it all has to do with you, with them blocking you, stopping your new beginnings, you, having you not be in charge of your life, your pathway. Like, they don't want you being an individual. Like, you are someone that has authority over your life. You are independent. And they're trying to put an end to your independence. You're an empress energy. And you're, you stand to take some type of new direction in life. Or you're about to take some type of new direction in life. Some of you may end up moving or something of that nature. And they are trying to stop all of that from happening. Especially when it comes to, to you having some type of fresh start. With a king of pentacles out here. They don't want you doing that. Uh, there's a woman out here that's desperate to be seen as hardworking, committed, and she ain't none of the above. And I think people know what it is this woman's about. She's nothing but a thief on a mission to steal somebody's abundance, trying to hide the truth, right? Block someone from growing. All of that is coming to an end because someone is being looked into. There's an investigation going on. Someone feels very entitled to things that do not belong to her. This is a woman that's very toxic and karmic as can be, okay? Very toxic. Someone's very desperate to have something. I'm telling you, the truth is out. Someone may be leaving an institution to come and tell you the truth. Or you are receiving wish fulfillment because the truth is out. People have clarity now about an empress in reverse. Someone that's very low vibrational. <laughs> someone, she pretends to be in the upright. This is someone that pretends to be religious. She's not really religious. Doesn't even care about the religion that she's practicing. It, it pisses. I just, I just saw someone get real agitated. Like the religion that she's pretending to be so devoted to, it pisses her off. She doesn't want to be associated with it because she's a false person. She wants to be able to be low vibrational in peace. It's what she said. Let me just be low vibrational in peace. I don't want to have to come out here anymore to pretend to be da 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 da. But someone is so accustomed to doing that because it gets her what she wants, right? There's some type of uh, judgment that's been made or decision that's been made. And I don't think she's liking it. Someone could be going through a divorce as well. It's a whole lot going on in this woman's life. She's under some type of judgment. But someone is going through either a divorce, uh, something's not, yeah, she's going through some type of ending. I said divorce, split the deck, and it went under deaths. Yeah, so she's going through some type of ending, which is bringing balance into a situation. And it's going to lead to you receiving some type of ace of pentacles that's going to enable you to explore your other options in life and things like that. Someone may want to give to you or invest in your work. This could be an emperor that's coming towards you, that's listening to his intuition to have this new beginning with you, right? So whatever else he's been working on, he's who are putting an end to it and planning to come towards you to have a new beginning. And it has people in distress that this man wants to give to you or that you're going to be receiving some type of financial offer that's going to enable you to take some type of new path in life. Have you introspecting? Have you been out here being the wise owl that you are? Okay. So people are in distress, distress. I don't know what to tell you, but they're angry, angry that they cannot cause any type of stagnation for you. Uh, in the long run, you're still going to be out here, self-master, independent, okay, a free agent. This is what they're trying to block, is to block someone from being a, a free agent in whatever way. And I don't mean like, you, you, you could be like an athlete, you could be an artist, even people that do divination, that you're a free agent. You don't work with other people, you work by yourself, right? Things like that. So they don't want you being a free agent, they want you binded. Because they all may have taken some type of oath, whatever, and they end up bonded in some type of situation. So someone feels like they have to bind you to a situation. But the most high say, nah, I don't think so. We don't told you to leave this person alone. Someone is going to have to walk away because it's like they stand to lose more messing with you than leaving you alone. So eventually she's going to have to leave you alone. The community is going to have to leave you alone because they're losing quite a lot behind the scenes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I knew this heifer was going to come out. One of ones in reverse. People don't want to collaborate with this woman anymore. They're seeing her as someone that is on scale. Uh, someone that is not even worth their time. They may even look down on this person at this point because they're noticing something about her mental. 
someone is not talented, someone is not skilled, someone is not educated, like she said she was. And I'm not saying that she doesn't have a degree. It says she got the degree, but she didn't do the studying to get the degree. There's some type of cheating with this person. That someone, all they know how to do is cheat to get what it is that they want. Uh, so the mental skills, the capabilities, the uh, 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 innovation, maybe there's nothing there. It's just someone pretending and playing a role. This is a false empress. I don't know if this person was pretending to be pregnant or something with this empress reversed in front of her as well. Someone could have been pretending to be pregnant or maybe someone around her that was in cahoots. Maybe I don't know. Okay, but what I know, one thing for two, one thing for sure, two things for certain. This is a false empress and the truth is being revealed about her. Someone pretends. All she knows how to do is pretend. This is a false religious energy. You know, those people that pretend to be so religious, holier than thou, uh, they don't drink wine, they don't do this, they don't uh, fornicate, but then you end up finding out like they're the masters of fornication. They don't commit adultery, but all they do is sleep with people's husbands. Uh, they don't cheat, but they got two, three other lovers on the side, men or women, men, women, or both, and they still are married. I see the higher fan out here. The, whoever these women are, hopeless. Hopeless. I told you, they're going to have to walk away, and they're in fear of that. They're going to have to walk away. It's okay that all oh, that was cute, but it's time to go. People don't want to collaborate with this woman anymore. They're seeing her like for what she is. It's that this is what you've been doing the whole time behind the scenes. And you've been telling us that you what? <laughs> yeah, the collaboration is over with her. The whole group is dismantled. <laughs> Baby, everything is in the reverse. Could be a Sagittarius that refused to listen to his intuition or someone... Of high honor, refuse to listen to their intuition, or there could be something where it's like they're exposing the truth about her, like she's greedy. Because sometimes the high priestess in reverse has to do with someone that's very greedy. Someone could be a practitioner, but she's not gifted, so she has to steal from other people to make it seem like she's gifted, and she has to practice what it is that she's saying before she even talks to you. She don't want to be interrupted or disturbed when she's practicing her lines. Like me doing divination and having to practice the lines before I sit on here. You know how tedious that is? That is ridiculous. And I ain't doing it, folks. I ain't doing it. Like, we're going to ramble if we need to ramble. We're going to on here if we need to. But I ain't about to sit down and practice no line for nobody. That's not that's not authentic as, as at all. That You got to practice your divination, what you're going to say before you get on camera. What? That's not divination, baby. That is, that's a speech. You're giving us a speech. If you got to practice it, it's a speech. Anyways, this is someone that does not listen to their intuition. They operate from their lower energy with this high priestess in reverse, okay? And what you, your ancestors or your angels are doing is exposing this about this woman. And they're doing it in the worst way. One, they're freeing you. And two, in a sense, they're binding her by exposing her low vibrational activity, her inability to do whatever it is that she says she's capable of doing. Unskilled, untalented, low vibrational, has to go to a practitioner to do what it is that she wants to do or needs done. Uh, because this is not someone source is communicating with on a regular basis like that. Uh, when they're communicating with her, he said, did you stop doing what you told, what we told you to stop doing? No. If it's not that, but they ain't giving her no sauce. She don't get no sauce from the source. Nothing whatsoever. Okay. But this is someone very insecure. Both of these, I don't know if she was working with a, a Sagittarius or whatever. They were in a relationship, some type of partnership. That thing, that partnership, baby, is over. Their relationship is over. O-V-E-R-A. Over. Okay, the, I don't know who this woman is, but she's about to be having a hard time finding friends and <laughs> alliances. What? Yeah, baby, there ain't nothing good. Everything is an alarm system, a warning sign. We got the high priestess in the reverse, the moon in the reverse. This is someone that's just dark, insecure, low vibrational, into a lot of dark magic rituals. Someone does, someone faithfully. She's faithful to some type of religion because she faithfully does rituals and moon magic around the clock. So someone may be doing up to their old tricks again, doing some type of moon magic, trying to take what does not belong to them, trying to have people see her in a light that's not hers. It's something like that. Like 
Whoever this woman is, is a nutcase. Why she was hired or put in a position, it says a lot more about you all than it says about this nutcase here. It said, what was the reason? Maybe she looked good on paper. Or he got with her maybe because she looked cute. That's all she cares about is how she looks. That, that's what I just heard. She said, okay, that's all I need. I'm good looking. That's all I need. Lord have mercy. Uh, anyways, this meeting, be cautious of it. Because whoever is coming towards you, and honey, they are coming. They are coming. Whoever it is, be cautious. Because they're coming from this institution that's been working against you. There's a higher fan that's been working against you. Or there's a higher fan that's been sitting by and just watching everything play out. And maybe now they're deciding to make some type of judgment in a situation and put something, bring something to an end. Um, balance the situation out, let go of something. But whoever is coming towards you is disingenuous. They are being paid to come towards you. It's almost like for some of you, a twin flame was hired to come towards you because some of you, your twin flames are still on the lower energy. They're still operating out of their lower energy. So they were hired, paid to come towards you to present something to you as wish fulfillment uh, so that something can go in favor of a Empress in reverse, Queen of Wands in reverse. This could also be a mother-daughter duo, or this could be two friends working together, but there's some type of alliance between these two, if it's not the same person. There's some type of alliance or collaborative effort taking place behind the scenes amongst a group of people to destroy you. So whoever is coming towards you, don't, don't, don't say more than hello if you don't need to say more than hello and goodbye. They say hello, you say goodbye because there's some type of disingenuous nature to what it is they're coming towards you with. It's all plotted and planned, okay? But whoever you're supposed to meet with in divine timing, not this person, it's going to happen. It's something that's a secret you don't see coming, okay? Uh, also, what I'm picking up on is that the nutcase is coming towards you. This is a ritual. So there's some type of magic that's been done before this person is coming towards you. So that they can put you in some type of state of confusion. Because they're going to be speaking to you in a way where it's going to have you stuck in your mind. You're not confused about anything. If you've been picking up on this and that, your mind is right on the target. With that uh, temperance out here, you are right on the target with these people. So you are not confused. So just stay vigilant. Something is almost over. And I don't even think these people realize that it's almost over. Uh, or that it's over for them. Something is about to be dismantled and never again to be seen. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Stay blessed. I'll see you in my next read. Goodbye for now.